When the cardiac muscle cell is resting during diastole, it contains a very low cytoplasmic concentration of free calcium ions. And the membrane is essentially impermeable to calcium ions, keeping them outside. The cells do, however, contain substantial stores of calcium held within the sarcoplasmic reticulum. Both the extracellular calcium and the stored calcium are important for excitation contraction coupling. Both are needed to deliver enough calcium ions to the contractile proteins to evoke contraction. L-type calcium channels are located in the T-tubular membrane, which brings them close to the sarcoplasmic reticulum located throughout the cell interior. The sarcoplasmic reticulum is, in turn, arranged around the contractile proteins. So, when the muscle cell fires an action potential, the calcium channels open and allow calcium ions to enter the cell. This calcium is not enough by itself to evoke contraction. Its main role is to bind to ryanodine receptors on the sarcoplasmic reticulum. These receptors are calcium permeable ion channels that open in response to calcium binding. So calcium entering the cell evokes the release of more calcium from the sarcoplasmic reticulum through ryanodine receptors. It is this calcium that binds to the contractile proteins causing contraction. Calcium levels in the cytoplasm must be rapidly restored to baseline between contractions. The main mechanism to remove calcium from the cytoplasm is the sarcoendoplasmic reticulum pump, or CIRCA. It pumps calcium against the concentration gradient back into the sarcoplasmic reticulum, allowing the cell to relax and replenishing the store until the next action potential arrives. Calcium is also removed from the cell, mainly by the sodium calcium exchanger, which exchanges it for sodium ions. This exchanger makes use of the large transmembrane gradient of sodium that facilitates its entry and is set up by the sodium potassium ATPase or sodium pump. Note that the activity of Circa is under the control of a protein called phospholamban, which normally has an inhibitory effect on Circa. This inhibition can be removed by intracellular messengers, such as cyclic AMP and cyclic GMP, and this increases Circa activity, resulting in a higher rate of calcium accumulation into the sarcoplasmic reticulum. When the heart is beating rapidly, this mechanism allows the heart to relax faster between beats, while also ensuring that the store is refilled for the next excitation.